Hi, I'm Mike, and I'm here to talk about sterile sampling. Sampling is the best way to make sure that what you have specced out on paper is exactly what's happening in your process. Now, traditionally, we used to use a valve and sample into an open container. However, imagine if we want to test the water here to see if it's safe for drinking. We grab a cup with an open top, and we now have our representative sample. We're going to bring this to the analytical lab to see if they can test it for us. But on my way there, I run into my friend Wally. Hi. Achoo! That might be a problem. Hi, Ashley. Do you think you could analyze the sample for me? Thank you. So the problem would be that if we do have a contamination, we don't know if it's the sample itself or the drinking water. It's contaminated. There's a better way to do this. We can sample into a closed container, like a bag or a bottle, so that both the sample and the operator are protected. So once the bag is full, we need to disconnect it from the tank in a sterile method so that we can safely bring it to the analytical lab for testing. So now let me show you how to install a sampling system onto a tank. The first step is to take our holder and disassemble it so that we can install the containers onto it. By unscrewing the locking nut, you can pull apart the magazine and the base. The next step is to take our container, which is a closed sterile container. It's sterile from being gamma irradiated, and it's closed on each end so that we maintain sterility. Each of the containers gets loaded up into the holder like so. We want to make sure to fill all five of the holes so that we're not going to leak from our tank into the clean room. Once all five of the containers are loaded up, we take our stainless steel base and tighten it down with the locking nut. At this point, we're ready to install this onto our tank. So we take our loaded holder, make sure we install a gasket, and push it onto our NA Connect port. The four bolts on our NA Connect port need to be tightened down as to create a tight seal and prevent leaking. So once everything's tightened down, we're ready to steam the inside of our tank and sterilize everything. We can now begin sampling, removing the sample containers, and analyzing the sample. Thank you for watching our video, and good luck.